Over the past months, hundreds of Angolans from the Kunene province have been illegally crossing into Namibia in search of food and medical attention. There are three main entry points along the Angolan border in Nomsati region, mainly Omuvelo Wakasamane, Omahenene and Ruakana border posts. Although these crossing points are guarded by law enforcement authorities, communities living across the border have been finding ways to enter the country at undesignated points. Many of those are currently at Oshifo and Etunda, and they say they were forced to leave their country because of hunger and poverty. We have nothing to eat at our houses. We came here because both pensioners and veterans in Namibia are getting paid. So we decided to come here to get assistance too. Omsati Governor Echino Zenjala says it is imperative for the two countries to work together in improving the living conditions of its people. Namibia and Angola share a lot of commonalities, such as cultural and traditional ties between the two countries, the ecological diversities, but, uh, but above all is the, the sense of peace and stability and pan-Africanism towards the people of Africa. Angolan ambassador to Namibia, Jovelina Costa, says it is important for her government to find solutions together with the Namibian government. We will have to find a solution for our people living alongside the common borders. Issues regarding the current humanitarian crisis which are facing our people, we have to find a lasting solution and start the process soonest. Ambassador Costa says she and the Angolan consulate at Oshakati will work towards ways to provide food, tents and clothes for the displaced persons. <laughs>